Best thing I ever made for me is just roast chicken with vegetables and a little escarole. Everybody loves a roast chicken, but this is just, I think, the perfect roast chicken. I'm a chef. I got four restaurants in Manhattan. When you go home sometimes, you gotta just chill out and relax. And cooking chicken, for me, is probably the easiest thing to do. You're roasting your chicken in the pan, you're cooking your vegetables in the same pan, so it's basically a one-pan pickup, and the ingredients are not exotic. You can find them anywhere. I think it's a perfect dish. Here I am, back from the store to make my favorite meal. And you know, I'm, I'm very, very sort of organized when I like to cook at home, and people make fun of me when they come over. They go, what is wrong with you? I line everything up. It just makes me feel good. There we go. All the things you need to make a roast chicken. So I like to try to buy some type of naturally grown chicken. So here's how we do it. We take our chicken, and the first thing you want to do is you want to season it well. I always have a salt and pepper mixture. It's about 75% salt, 25% pepper. Then I usually stuff in a half of a lemon, a little bit of thyme, an onion, and then I always like to take a little garlic, put that in there as well. All right, and now we just need to truss it. You take it and you put both of the legs, you kind of make a figure eight. There's a couple of reasons for trussing a chicken. You want to make sure that all those aromatics are staying inside. And the second is that you want to make sure that the legs and the wings stay close to the bird. It cooks more evenly that way. And you want to hold it all together just like that. Flip her over. And this is very important. So you don't have to have somebody hold their finger there. Go twice. So then when you do that, it sort of holds it much better that way. And then I usually pour a little bit of olive oil over it and then season it on the outside. And I always say season with authority. If you don't season it enough, the salt and pepper is not going to really get into that skin and make it really tasty. Toss it in the oven. Oven's nice and hot at 450. 450 is pretty hot, and I think you really do need the heat to get that skin nice and crispy on the outside of the chicken. You're going to peel your carrots and cut them on a bias. Peel your shallots and you're gonna cut your potatoes in half. And then you're gonna toss all the vegetables in with the chicken while it's cooking, with all the juices that are gonna be coming out of the chicken, which is gonna be fantastic. When your chicken's ready, take it out. We're gonna check if it's cooked. And if the juices run clear, the chicken's cooked. She's ready to go. Let it rest. You're gonna scoop out the vegetables that are in there, drain off some of the fat. A little splash of olive oil. And we're going to wilt down our escarole. The escarole is a leafy green. It's a little less bitter than endive, but it's from the same family as the endive. Season them up a little bit, salt and pepper. After it wilts down a little bit, we're going to add a little bit of Dijon mustard, give it a little kick. I just love the combination of escarole and mustard. I think they belong together. So it takes about five minutes to wilt down the escarole. And that's a good thing, because you still got to let your chicken rest a bit before you cut it. So the juices sort of settle in the chicken. So not only is it the best chicken I ever made, but it's the best timed dish as well, because you can do one thing while the other thing's happening. That's what I love about it. It's moist, it's delicious, it's so juicy, and that skin is nice and crispy. It feels like the escrow almost absorbs the flavor of the chicken. Amazing. You don't have to get expensive ingredients and fancy things all the time to make good food. Just go get a chicken and do it right, and you'll be happy. A nice chicken dinner, a glass of red wine, great way to end of the day, huh? Cheers. 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 Cheers.